Hello, it is Divine Needle. My name is Nell. Uh, welcome to my channel. Last night I was streaming live free tarot readings, right? And <clears throat> I missed some people. So I'm doing some readings. I kind of promised to do everybody, but I will be doing a reading for what was it? Velvet? Scarlet Kitty. Scarlet Kitty. Scarlet Kitty. You have asked for a reading, so I will do one for you, okay? If you have any question, uh, keep your question in mind while you watch this reading and apply it to your reading, okay? Okay, I do hope this reaches you. I hope you are subscribed. Um, yeah, if not, well, I am trying, so yeah. Scarlet Kitty. Let's see what comes out for you. Right? Let's see. Scarlet Kitty. I pre shuffled this deck with your energy into it. Okay. Gotta be 10 cards killed across, like always. Uh, yeah, I don't even have to say that anymore because. Okay, what's the current situation for Scarlet Kitty? I love the name though. A lot of. Yeah, reminds me of my kitty. Yeah, cosmic kitty. Yeah, Scarlet Kitty. Current situation: Queen of Cups. Boom! Right of the bat. Hmm. Well, might might be good or bad. I do not know. What's the challenge with this Queen of Cups? been going down in the recent past for Scarlet Kitty. Down once. That's gonna go down in the near future for Scarlet Kitty. Hangman energy. Okay. That's good. What's the focus of you right now? What's the focus of Scarlet Kitty? Eight of coins. Cool, cool, that's good. It's real good. What's the subconscious trying to tell you? What is the advice for Scarlet Kitty? <laughs> that's just unreal. Tower in the advice again. That's three times in a row when I do these personal readings that tower comes into into the personal advice. <laughs> That's just unreal. Okay, okay. I will roll with it. I shuffle these decks really good every time. And you see what I'm doing. So that's telling me something. That's telling me something. Okay. How do you see yourself or want to see yourself? Scarlet Kitty. Tree of Coins. Okay. How do others see you or want to see you? How do others see Scarlet Kitty oh, or want to see you? Two of Cups. And six of Swords. So hopes and fears for Scarlet Kitty. Seven of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. And what's gonna be the final outcome for Scarlet Kitty? Oh, I feel I gotta take that one, so I will. Yes, High Priestess. Boom, that's awesome. Mm-hmm. Bottom of the deck for you. That's funny because you have 10 of wands here too. 
but Ten of Swords is a release of the mental burdens, okay? A lot of thinking going on, a lot of anguish, a lot of, yeah, mental conflict, okay? But it does signify that it is a release, especially in the bottom of the deck. But take that out, it applies and might be going on for you right now. But there you go. A lot of mental energy. But it does say that it's a release of that. Okay. It does look very negative, but it's a letting go of it. It's the end of the sorts. Yeah. So take that how it applies. Current situation for you, this might be you, the person, right? Could also be a lot of emotions going on for you right now okay uh, this could be good emotions bad emotions um, could be feelings for somebody else okay the challenge with that <laughs> that's funny because queen of wands i feel this is a person blocking you maybe you are in love with somebody okay and this person might be with a queen of wands it might be with somebody else you do not know if that applies but it could be um, it could also be that um, you are very emotional right now okay and what's blocking that is looking into your heart and yeah seeing the big picture and the reason why I say that that is because you have the hangman here too yeah it's like an energy of why am i feeling this why am i feeling these feelings you know and it doesn't make sense that's what i'm trying to get at it might not make sense for you okay but it could be legit a person blocking you okay recent past for you ten of wands releasing the burdens this could be projects in your life okay a lot of stuff going on in the physical uh, this could be things that you enjoy even but it could also be uh, things that you do not like okay but it does signify it being in the past that it is a release it could be still going on but in the past it could be a release that a relief of the burdens okay could be a love but it could also be completely something else okay um, these Celtic cross readings uh, the suits it's it's very fluent okay not the meanings but the, the suits yeah I'll learn that over my time okay like I said in the future you you are gonna gain a better perspective of a situation okay like I said, it could be that you're gonna look inside your heart and and go on like, why am I feeling this? Why? What's the use of this kind of energy? It could also be in another field, um, taking a step back and looking at the world right now and seeing the bigger picture, trying to anyway. But yeah, the reason why I feel that is your other future cards. I will come to that later. You focus right now, you are focused very much on something. Attention to detail, dedicated work. Okay, it could be in a job, but it could also be in something else. Yeah, something that you are passionate about. Yeah, dedicated work. Um, weird noises. I'm not alone, I know that. Ghost stuff. But yeah, dedicated work to something, attention to detail. Um, mm -hmm. um, take that how it applies. Maybe you want this, you want to do this, but uh, I feel you are doing that. Okay. And it could be, but yeah, however that applies. It is coins, so it could be a job. Maybe you love your job, love to do that. Um, maybe you are overworking right now. I know everybody's in quarantine and stuff, but the people that are still working are doing overtime that could indicate this too now the advice that's really crazy like i said in the beginning you are the third person in a row to have the tower in the advice 
That is, I'm not gonna say it impossible, but it seems to be possible. Yeah, the chances are so low to have this three times in a row. That's nuts to me. But yeah, tower in the advice that tells me you must take some action of some sort. The tower is divine intervention, good or bad. It could be, it could be both too, but um, it's definitely telling me be the lightning be the divine intervention you must shake something up in your world if you want to advance okay you will know what that is i feel you will know what that is but you must you must take action How you see yourself or want to see yourself. Teamwork. Teamwork. This could be in love. This could also be legit at the job place. You might be wanting to work together with somebody. Okay. But also you could already be doing that too. Yeah. Teamwork. That's how you see yourself. Now yeah, maybe you want to be together with somebody because there is a card here in the next position. How others see you and want to see you. Two of Cups. A union of some sort. Okay. Perhaps uh, your family wants you to, to be in a relationship or in a new relationship. Okay. Um, this could also indicate friends. Okay. It doesn't have to be romantic, but uh, it could be. Right? Family, friends want to see you in a relationship of some sort they also want you either to travel to somewhere move out or they want to see you in a calmer state of mind i feel it's more of a calm state of mind because we do have the ten of swords here remember all the mental anguish mental thinking processes processes however you say that yeah moving on to calmer waters mentally or travel, but I, I don't see it here. I don't see it here. No. Hopes and fears. Sowing the seeds for the future and taking care of those seeds. Yeah, this could be in the form of um, money. Okay, could also be your body. Okay, could be anything material in your life, even your house, cleaning up your house, dead, fixing up your house. Things like that. Working in the yards. Yeah. Stuff like that. Could also be with the steamwork. Yeah. Working together. Maybe you are trying to move closer to somebody. Scarlet Kitty. Could be. Definitely a hope. Last final outcome, yeah, high priestess. You are gonna use your hearts, well, more of your intuition, your gut instincts, and your wisdom to see the bigger picture. Yes, I feel it has everything to do with this hang hangman energy. Yeah, I feel you are gonna get a better perspective, whatever is going on with you, okay, because hangman is taking a step back and seeing the big picture, right. And this is using your intuition and wisdom to gain a better uh, picture. I'm sorry. To gain a better picture of the unknown. Yeah, because we do have the moon here. The moon is very mysterious energy. But um, yeah. Gaining a better picture of it. Yeah. Using your intuition and wisdom. Mm -hmm. So that's looking pretty good for you. But my advice for you be. Be the lightning, be the tower. Yes. Mm -hmm. I feel you must take action in something. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, you will know what that is. Yeah. Okay. There you go, Scarlet Kitty. Let's see what the angels have to say. <clears throat> angel card. The cardboard angels. Okay, that will want to go, so I will pick it. 
divine order. Archangel Raguel. Everything is how it needs to be right now. Look past the illusion and see underlying order. Wow. Hope that resonates a little bit for you. So there you go. I hope this uh, reaches you. And <clears throat> comment, like, subscribe if you haven't already. Let me know how this resonates for you. You can also donate if you feel like doing that. There should be a link in the description. And you can donate any amount that you feel is equal to the value of your reading. Yeah. And I hope to see you this evening. Yeah. Come share your energy. Yes. I will be streaming again and again and again. Yeah. I love doing that. But it takes a lot of energy. Definitely. But it's fun. So come check us out. Well, check me out. Share your energies. Okay, I hope you have a good weekend and a good week coming up. Okay. <laughs>